All right, going to show some examples of Illuminati, Eye of Horus symbolism in some Hollywood celebrity, Hollywood you can call it, celebrity music videos. You see, signs and symbols, they mean things. I'm going to bring that up a little bit later on. Let's get right into the pictures. So, of course, the first picture, a very well-known example, is Katy Perry's music video, where she is in this pagan Egyptian uh, uniform, and she has the all-seeing Eye of Horus, the Illuminati symbol, the Eye of Horus, the Egyptian god Horus, right in front of her, you know, blatantly you know, but subliminally also showing that she is picturing the Illuminati symbolism. And of course, people say, oh, you're just a conspiracy theorist. Uh, again, signs and symbols, they mean things. And you don't just put these kind of symbols for no reason. They mean things. She's projecting a message subliminally to her audience, the people that watch that video. A very popular music video. It got like hundreds of millions of views. I think even billions, if I'm not mistaken. And then she's flashing this Illuminati symbolism of the pagan all-seeing eye of Horus right in front of her for all her young fans to see. And of course, oh, that's just a one little example. Well, let's see some more examples of this. Here is Beyonce at the Super Bowl, her performance at the Super Bowl, flashing the triangle symbol of the Illuminati with the pyramid with the all-seeing eye of Horus on top. Okay? So it's not just one isolated example. This kind of stuff is all over the music, the Hollywood music industry. These Illuminati signs and symbols. All right, so basically had a bit of a problem right there on the, with the camera, but you saw right there how she's flashing that all-seeing, you know, Eye of Horus, the pyramid symbol of the Illuminati. And it's not just like a, a kooky conspiracy theorist. This is kind of stuff that's all over the music industry. Here's a picture of Rihanna. She's worth over a billion dollars, by the way. She's a billionaire. And she's flashing this same triangle symbol in her music video. Okay? And again, oh, it's just a coincidence. Is it really? Again, look into things yourself. Don't just believe what you're told all the time. Look into actually, be a brain and look into things yourselves. So she's flashing that symbol and while she's doing her performance. Why? Because they're showing who their allegiance is to. Now here's a really, really telling picture of Ariana Grande, who is showing the enlightenment of Lucifer, the, Lucif the Luciferian Illuminati enlightenment. What does the Illuminati mean? The enlightened ones, Illuminati, which is, which is founded, they're founded by a Jesuit, by the way, too, which is a whole other issue. The Jesuit order is totally Luciferian. But you see her, she has the one-eyed symbolism with the light going through it. What does that symbolize? Again, the false light that Lucifer brings, the Luciferian enlightenment. You see, you read Genesis chapter 3, verses 3 to 5, Satan tells Eve, your eyes will be opened, you know, if you eat of this fruit. You read uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verses 4 to 6, the light that Lucifer brings, he brings a light, but it's a blinding light. It's light that blinds, it's, it's an enlightenment that blinds you to the truth. 2 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 14 says that Satan appears as an angel of light. You see, you read John chapter 9, verses 35 to 39, the light that Jesus Christ brings, it opens your eyes to the truth. It leads you out of darkness. But the light that Lucifer brings, it is indeed an enlightenment, but it's a blinding light that blinds you to the truth. And Ariana Grande, which, you know, she is a, a complete Satanist. She, she practices the Jewish Kabbalah. Uh, she's a Satanist, and uh, she is, she, her, her God is a woman music video, had all kinds of, of subliminal sexual uh scenes and all kinds of subliminal sexual immodesty and all kinds of occult symbols in it and basically just blossom blossomously portraying god as a woman which is you know side issue i could do a whole other video on that showing all the occult symbols in that video but she is depicting obviously the the luciferian enlightenment that comes with the illuminated ones the illuminati now here is uh jay-z at one of his performances doing again the triangle symbol and again flashing that symbol. Again, why do they just flash these symbols? Why? Because they're showing who their allegiance is to. It's not just a nutty conspiracy theorist. It is just subliminally showing. You see, it goes into your subconscious, plain and simple. Now here is another picture of Kesha, another uh, Hollywood celebrity, in her music video, uh, showing the Eye of Horus on her hand. Very significant, because you read Revelation chapter 13, where does the mark of the beast go into? In the forehead or in the hand? So, very subliminally showing the uh, mark of the beast essentially in her hand, in her in her forehead or in her hand, because it goes in either one. And I do believe the Illuminati, they are working around the clock to prepare the world for the new world order, plain and simple. The Illuminati, the Freemasons and their masters at the Jesuit, and, at the Jesuit order and the Vatican. But she is subliminally depicting the Illuminati Eye of Horus as well as the mark of the beast, from uh, which will be instituted by the Antichrist by the way too that will be instituted in the New World Order. And again, oh, oh, you're just a nutty conspiracy theorist. 
Yeah, you can call me that all you want. People have been calling Bible believers conspiracy theorists for a long time now. We're used to it. But those are just a few examples of Illuminati symbolism in celebrity music videos. It's not just one little isolated example, it's all over the place. And you just look hard enough, you'll find it in there. Because it'll go into your subconscious. They won't, they won't show it openly. But remember, signs and symbols, they mean things. They don't just do these things for no reason. So I just wanted to show you guys that. Just a little warning about the Illuminati presence in the music industry. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.